What is going on my fellow fellas, it is your boy Illumini here, and today I am going to be doing the town box roulette challenge, or like town but I have to get a new box gun every round. So pretty much every single round we're gonna have to get a new box gun. Um, I started on round 5 just to progress the video a bit. I have a goal of getting to around like round 20, 25, something like that, and that may sound easy but I have a couple like caveats in place. Oh yeah, first First of all, we should probably find the box and get a gun so that we don't get like fucking killed immediately. But yeah, I have a couple of caveats in place. Uh, number one is we only have a two perk limit, so I have to choose what two perks I want, including quick revive. Number two is I'm only allowing myself one pack a punch. So should I get like a really bad gun on say like round 15? I'm only gonna allow myself, oh wow. Anyways, as I was trying to say, um, the music was really loud so I couldn't talk, but yeah. Should I get a really bad gun on like round 20 or like 15 or something like that? I'm only going to allow myself to actually upgrade the gun and make it better once. So say I get like the ballistic knife on like round 12 or something and I decide that I really don't wanna use it. So I pack a punch it. And then I get like the ballista, or not the ballista, the fucking Barrett on like round 17. I now can't pack a punch it because I already used my one pack a punch. And that's pretty much the rules. Uh, round five got the M8A1, so that's pretty chill. Solid gun. Hopefully we don't fucking die immediately this time again. I don't know what I'm going to get in terms of perks, though I do have a pretty good idea. Double tap is definitely going to be on the list just in case we get a bad gun. And the other one is more than likely going to be Jug because it's pretty essential. Let me know what other maps you want to see me do this challenge on. Let me know what you guys want to see in terms of videos and streams in the comments. Like and sub if you do end up enjoying this video. Drop me a Q&A question down below because I still want to do that for 1k sub even though it's a bit a bit of ways away right now but you know that's not a bad thing thank you join the discord if you want to hang out with me or other people who like zombies and uh yeah oh shit okay i didn't realize it's round six we need our new gun oh yeah by the way i was gonna say this last time but i got fucking killed we're oh wow uh we're gonna allow ourselves the use of the 1911 so like for example on insta kill i can still use it or not on insta kill whatever i'm not gonna ban myself from using the 1911 oh my gosh I don't know how I lived there, but I'm glad I did because I don't want to restart for a third damn time. I need to get out of this stupid corner. But yeah, what I was going to say, I don't think I'll ever like take the 1911 out of the list of guns that I'm able to use in a challenge. I mean, you spawn with it. It's not very good. It's just a bunch of things. Why not allow the use of the 1911? It's really not that great it kind of just serves as getting points oh another double points how nice well i gotta go grab jug real quick also doesn't this remind you of the 1k special running around this part of town with the fucking rpg all right jug acquired and oh that was last um i'm gonna pick up this double points and then go spin our box gun hopefully we don't get like if we get the war machine then like at any point in this video it doesn't matter what round it is we are no way Okay, there's no way that just happened. All right, well, now I really need to show out. I can't, I was gonna say, if we get the war machine at any point in this video, we're pretty much cooked. Yeah, that ain't happening now. I am, I'm living with this thing. What a fucking coincidence, holy. You know, I haven't made a YouTube short in a while, but I think I might make one just for that. Oh man, the war machine is so bad. It's not even the fact that it's a grenade launcher. It's the fact that it's a grenade launcher that doesn't like explode on impact. And then it's also the fact the ricochet is so fucking insane and then it's also the fact that the mobility is super shitty and there was another thing but i forgot because the list of things that are bad about this gun is ever long by fucking foo fighters oh yeah i, f I remembered wow that did a lot there but it fucking whenever the grenades make contact with lava they burn up so you just cannot use them this fucking gun is literally better as an impact grenade launcher that doesn't blow up than it is as an actual grenade launcher like it's a two-shot kill three four maybe to the zombies if i just direct impact them also i'm gonna save this insta kill for next round should we get a really shitty gun direct impact you nice well the war machine round is over thankfully and we got off with zero bullets left 
Cap 40, sick. Okay, well, at least we have this. What a perfect time to grab double tap as well. This video is gonna feel like it's gonna go by fast, but it's definitely gonna get a bit harder later on. I mean, we've already had two decently difficult rounds, the RPG and the War Machine back to back. That RPG round was crazy. I don't know how I got out of like this area alive. Also, it might be the end of this round already. Wishful thinking, it's fine. The cap 40 won't be horrible right now. Man, my channel is really just built on fucking videos on town. I've had some great videos on town. A lot of them too. Some great, some not. I used to do this uh, SMR only challenge. Ooh, M887 or one again. I used to do this SMR only challenge every time I hit a quote unquote 69 milestone. That was a lot of fun. If you don't know what I mean though, pretty much like every time I hit 69 subs, then 169, 269, I would do a video where I just only use the SMR. Now you might think that that got repetitive, but I actually think they made for some really cool videos. There was this one where I just kept on getting jump scared. <laughs> Zombies would just fucking come around the corner and just scare the shit out of me. Then I had the, uh, I had the jet gun on town tutorial video. That one was great. If I remember, I definitely got to link that video. If you haven't seen that, it is definitely worth the watch it's a joke video that i didn't mean to upload on april fools but it happened to come out on april fools that's definitely the peak of my my channel my magnum opus if you will new gun though uh hammer okay this round i can just sit in this corner and provide useless commentary <laughs> so i probably won't do any more videos on uh bo6 just because they didn't do too well also i don't really know what else i can do on bo6 obviously i could just implement the challenges that i do on non bo6 maps into bo6 you know just choose choose a cool topic and mix it with a relevant topic and that makes for a good video, but the algorithm, I guess, doesn't like my BO6 videos, so back to everything else, which I enjoy making videos on the older CODs more anyway, so it works out. That round went by extremely fast because of that fucking hammer plus insta-kill. Yeah, new gun. What are we gonna get? Uh, ray gun. Okay, once again, I can just sit in the corner and do nothing. Honestly, I think we might just do a points challenge instead, rather than a uh, rounds challenge. Maybe like 30k points? I don't know. I'll decide once I get closer to the goal, because I don't want to get to 30k too fast because we're not going to be spending any more points we can't even buy quick revive Ooh, okay this is no bueno never mind we're fine i don't like how long the ray gun reload takes it's a very non-valid thing to complain about considering that the ray gun is like good but you know what i'm gonna complain about it so <laughs> all right what are we getting rpg again straight back to training yeah i am not sitting in the corner for this one i shouldn't really have too much of a problem training with the rpg considering i had to do it for trying to get 1000 kills you know this uh this part of the map is kind of meta for training with the rpg not gonna lie i think by round 12 i had it pack a punch though not sure but like it's it's really good i don't know in the beginning of the video i'm referring to the 1k uh, fucking sub special by the way if any of you guys haven't watched it but in the beginning of the video i thought that i was gonna be super cooked because i got the rpg and it still ended up being really difficult. I probably would have taken any other gun besides the SMR, War Machine, and the Barret. But the RPG, you know, it wasn't it wasn't horrible. I, you just have to play around it. If you train well enough, this thing is super good. All right, gotta make sure I get back to the box in time before the next round starts and I have to kill zombies with my old gun. All right, come on, give me something good. Oh, the, oh my, that is actually horrible. Okay, I don't know whether or not to allow myself to use my RPG for now. I think I will once I get up there. How about that? Wait, okay, hold on. Pro strats. We have a carpenter, so the barrier up there is fully built. Oh no. The barrier up there is fully built, and if I just train all the zombies out here, let the box spawn in, I can get a box spin. Okay, I'm gonna throw a couple nades though. Okay, it does not seem like the barrier is... Oh, the barrier is rebuilt. Okay, that's sick. Come on, give me a new gun. <gasps> oh my gosh, this shit calm. This thing sucks. Wow, I'm surprised I actually got that. That was clutch. Man, I didn't even think that the teddy bear could come out for some reason. All right, I'm just gonna spare no time, grab that nuke. I don't want to get caught with the shit calm. All right, new gun, and I can actually spin the box safely this time. Ooh, Galil, okay. This might be a camping in corner type around, except that we're gonna camp in a different corner this time. All right, so this is a question that I need like everyone's feedback on. Uh, no more corner camping, I guess, but I keep on talking about live streaming, right? I'm sure some of you guys know. Um, then I just don't stream. I think part of the reason why is because I, I really want to stream, but I never want to set it up, especially if nobody's gonna watch. So 
what I am asking is what day out of the week or what days out of the week do you think would be best for a stream? Because if I can get some like community input on this, I could probably set up like a hour, two hour, three hour stream at least once a week. Okay, we are not going to count that, but I will take those. I guess I'm not going to use them though. I think, uh, I think 25 or 30k points is fine. Also, we got the Barrett, so this is not good. We really got to focus up on this round. But yeah, just let me know what day out of the week and what time maybe even you guys want to see me stream because i still want to stream despite all my oh uh, despite me saying i want to stream and then just not streaming so this double point is big i'm gonna use my 1911 here because that is not an illegal move in this challenge oh wow oh no oh my gosh wow okay <laughs> well that that was a horrible idea you know we probably could have even survived with the barret if i just used it well i don't want to give up on the challenge just yet but i also don't want to restart from square one so i think i'm just going to go to round 15 and continue trying to get 25 or 30k points so we'll spawn in with 7500 but we gotta grab our perks i just gotta lock the fuck in this time oh okay box is in the good part of the map see that's why i should have maybe gone with quick revive as one of my perks but at the same time double tap is just too important same with jug obviously but that's just a fucking given oh wow the m8a1 is a three burst on round 15 with jug or with uh with jug with double tap oh wow i am not gonna be able to grab it so if any of you guys thought uh starting off on round 15 was an unfair oh my gosh fuck okay well i'm just gonna restart at the same point okay as i was saying if any of you guys think that starting off in round 15 was a bit unfair uh let me remind you we're only gonna have like 2,000 points oh my gosh we're only gonna have like 2,000 points at the end of our spending spree man i hate that the zombies fucking can spawn up here even though there's no door bot up here okay just give me jug and let me get the fuck out please i have no interest in sticking around for these games okay now let me do the same with uh double tap Huh? Thankfully, the- Oh my gosh, this is gonna be fucking- I fucking- Oh my- Dude, oh. I was gonna say, this is gonna be a fucking writing the needle moment, but no, that's not, no. Alright, one more time. This is all that it will take to get a successful run, is what I was trying to say. Just give me a decent gun, a half fucking decent gun. War machine. Okay, ah, uh, this is all right, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna try and grab double tap real quick. Oh, okay, we're not gonna get double tap. Ah, oh, damn it. Why couldn't we have gotten an insta-kill or a nuke? I am so cooked here. Wait, maybe not. Okay. Oh, I need all these zombies to fucking... Damn it, no, not the same exact place, dude. Motherfucking fuck. You know what? I was gonna call it quits there, and then I realized something. I'm fucking... I'm him, so I don't need to. And I'm not gonna go on to an earlier round because I don't want to. <laughs> yeah, so I decided that um, this this time we were actually going to complete the challenge, like on this on this game in particular. I decided that we were gonna beat the challenge because I wanted to, you know? So that's why I'm gonna get a good gun here, naturally, because, you know, I decided that I'm him. And that max ammo, predetermined as well. Not that I really need it, but, you know, I just gotta, gotta show off my powers and shit. Jug uncontested, you know, because I... I really just decided for that to happen. So yeah, we're just, we're, we're gonna beat it this time around. All right, so we're in the same position as we were last time. We have our two perks, except we don't have like 10K points how we used to or however many. Okay, I think this will be a good opportunity to pull out the 1911. These could potentially be famous last words, but hopefully not. Hopefully these are famous money-making words. Ooh, Carpenter, that's gonna be useful for this challenge, so I'll pick it up. All right, well, just like that, we've boosted our pointage by a lotage. Now, because I wanna win this time, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna give myself the, uh, the foul here, you know, not a horrible gun, but, oh, okay, I really need a gun. I guess my powers aren't working anymore. All right, RPD, that's sick. I can just camp here. Insta-kill, okay. More like fucking reload time than use the 1911. Or my knife, because I'm just him. And my mic is, like, kind of exactly in the way of the insta-kill, so I need to make sure I... Yeah, okay, the insta-kill ran out. But it was, like, locking the fucking the perk or the drop icon. Did I just get another insta-kill? Is that what just happened in this exact moment of time? Relative timeness? Another double points. Probably gonna train this round so that I can... Use my 1911 a bit. All right, DSR, we're definitely training now. Okay, 
Um, around 19k more points to go. Okay, I'll grab this as late as possible. There we go. Oh, this thing is great. It's still one, it's mist making and fucking doing collateral damage as well. Oh, I am red screen. That is not healthy. Not recommended for your daily dose of zombies health. Okay, that, there's a nuke over there. It, I think it would be within my best interest to... Holy shit, I ah, try and grab that because it is rather difficult training with a sniper rifle. Okay, come on, come on, yes, let's go. Couldn't get too many points, but I mean, with the DSR, I'm not going to really get that many points anyway, so. Round 18, um, new gun time. Hopefully I get something that can make points, like the Type 25 or the ray gun that works too, I guess. Not really, actually, I don't know why I said that. Ooh, if we got a double points, that'd be nice. All right, that was a pretty shitty round for points pretty sure we only got like a 2000 profit so that sucks come on something bien oh yeah okay i love this how generous of you to give me my favorite guns in the whole zombies franchise see look at how efficient my favorite guns are look at how many points we've already made and they do solid damage for round 19 oh my gosh no that was almost horrid oh we are rapidly approaching our goal Okay. Ah, man, I really didn't want to buy that, but I thought we were going to be cooked there. Oh, wow. Okay, we need to fucking get over there. Oh, wait, we got a carpenter. Never mind, we're fine. No, I didn't pick it up. Oh, okay, I did pick it up. I didn't see my points go up. All right, new gun. Would be nice if I just got the single wield 5.7. Oh, what the f Okay, uh, thanks. I guess my powers are back or something. And man, it really sucks that this fucking speed cola door is open now. Oh, I don't have much ammo. Oh, that is... Okay, well, we haven't gotten a max ammo in a couple rounds, so we can hope for one this time around. Definitely gotta try and get some collat damage here, though. Or double points, that works too. We might be able to end the challenge on this round if I, like, get a super efficient amount of points. Hold on. Oh my gosh, we are super fucking close. No, why would you give me a nuke? I'm so close. Oh, I am 1k points off. Oh no. Okay, I beat it. I fucking beat it. Yeah, okay. Well, let's go. All right. Well, that's the end of the video. Um, thank you guys for watching. I prevailed in the end. Something you usually don't see in an Illumity challenge. Me actually winning. Thank you all for watching. It's 4 a.m. 420 to be precise. Uh, I gotta get to editing. So, yeah. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like and sub if you did. Go on my Discord if you want to hang out with me or other people who like zombies. Tell me when you guys want to see me stream. What you guys want to see me stream. And other stuff stuff yeah video ideas leave me a q a question in the comments down below literally like ask me anything i don't know and yeah thank you all for watching and as always peace